Welcome back to Plasma Channel. Now, we've all heard of physics, right? It explains the workings of virtually everything around you. Your car depends on it, your heart beats to the laws of physics, and even the very screen you're watching this video on is a slave to physics. But the discovery and advancement of physics has not always been intentional. You may not know, but tons of discoveries were flat up accidental. So I give you five accidental discoveries in physics that changed the world. One thing about discovery is that it favors the prepared mind and is usually premised with the words, that's funny. Likely one of the most common sayings in science and it's a tell that things are about to change. And that's certainly the case with the first discovery, x-rays. In Würzburg, Germany in 1895, Wilhelm Röntgen was experimenting with cathode ray tubes. CRTs are basically a vacuum with high voltage applied. Well, he suddenly saw something on a nearby barium screen that spooked him, and rightfully so. He saw the skeleton of his hand projected onto the screen. Something was penetrating his flesh, but not his bones. He later discovered this to be caused by what he called x-rays. Equally as influential is the second discovery, radioactivity. In 1896 in France, Henri Becquerel attempted to research x-rays further. He placed a sample of uranium on his messy desk near some unexposed photographic plate. But to his disappointment, he later found that the photographic plate, though covered from light, became exposed and ruined. Sucks to suck. After reportedly saying, oh, that's weird, and conducting a lot of additional research, he concluded that the uranium emits some kind of rays that penetrated the paper covering of the plate. Well, his doctoral student, Marie Curie, later named it radioactivity. Rewinding the clock a bit, we have our third accidental discovery. We see it every New Year's and often for target practice. I'm talking gunpowder. In the 9th century in China, alchemists were trying to create a potion for immortality. It was composed of potassium nitrate, common charcoal, and sulfur. Well, it kind of had a flaw. They kept having problems with their buildings bursting into flames and exploding, and their alchemists kept getting burned. That's because they invented gunpowder. And gunpowder isn't necessarily associated with extending life. But it did change the world a bit. The fourth discovery completely happened upon by accident is electromagnetism. Back to Europe again, in 1820 in Denmark, scientist Hans Christian Ørsted was doing a lecture on electricity and magnetism. He was teaching they don't influence each other. Placing a wire next to a compass and hooking up the wire to a battery, the compass didn't move much. So to further prove his point, he moved the wire around the compass. But to his shock, this time the compass needle actually swung away from the wire. He tried several more spots and noticed a pattern of the compass always being perpendicular to the wire. This is something that he just didn't notice before the lecture. So ironically, he discovered electromagnetism while trying to prove that the two don't affect one another. Thankfully, he was wrong. And the last on today's list changed how we cooked food forever. I'm talking microwaves and the microwave oven. During World War II in 1945 in the USA, Percy Spencer worked for Raytheon, developing microwave radar transmitters. At that time, microwaves were merely for communication. But one day while experimenting, he noticed that a candy bar in his pocket started to melt, and quite violently. Through trial and error, he found that the microwaves from the radio set he was working on actually influences the structure of food and heats it up. Ultimately, he discovered that microwaves can be used to heat food, and the microwave oven soon followed. Crazy stuff. Now, of course, there's tons of other discoveries that changed the world, but I wanted to touch on these five. Now, I'd also like to mention who makes this globe. It's an incredible embodiment of physics, and one of the five discoveries is implemented in how it functions. It's made by a company called Mova Globes, and it's one of the most beautiful table pieces I've ever seen. It's basically a globe inside of a plexiglass sphere, and it's solar powered. So whether you use natural light or artificial light, 
it just sits there inside the globe and rotates. That's pretty cool. Um, I'll also put the link down below where you can find it and a million other options. These options include star map globes, other planets, famous artwork, and even sports. I'd like to leave you with some food for thought. Thank God those people wrote down what they saw with those experiments. Because quite frankly, if they didn't write down what they saw, they wouldn't have been discoveries. Because quite frankly, the only difference between screwing around and science is writing stuff down. Thanks for stopping by, and don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to Plasma Channel. Check us out on other social media, and feel free to check out our various other episodes. With science every two weeks, you stay classy.